Hello everyone, it is I, your man Nippon Sharma, and welcome back to another video. This is going to be the preview for our fixture against Everton. And yeah, I'm actually quite confident going into this game. And having said that, we should not take this team lightly. They are being coached by one of the greatest managers of all time, in my opinion, Carlo Ancelotti. I mean, he's nowhere near as good... A, he is still a good manager, put it that way. In fact, one of the best managers in the league right now. And he has coached us in the past, but obviously now he is returning to Stamford Bridge in the opposition dugout. And we actually have quite a good record against Everton at the bridge. Every time we've met them in the past, since 1994, yeah, since 1994, they have not beaten us at the bridge. But having said that, under Carlo Ancelotti, Everton are actually a really good team away from home. They they beat Tottenham on the first day of the season. I think it was 1-0 Dominic Calvert-Lewin. I might have to check that out quickly. Um, yeah, I think it was Dominic Calvert-Lewin. I think they, they secured a point against Man United in the dying seconds of the game at Old Trafford. Um, and they beat Liverpool at Anfield. Like, I think it was in their last game. So, yeah, they're, they're a good team away from home. So, we cannot... Act, we, we, can, we cannot be complacent. But, but in our last five games, we are unbeaten. Winning three. Drawing two. And since Thomas Tuchel has taken over as Chelsea manager. We are unbeaten in all competitions. Yeah, with that being said, we move on to our starting lineup, as we always do. And in this case, I'm actually going to do a combined 11 as well and predict Carlo Ancelotti's predicted 11 for for his Everton side. So yeah, let's get right into the video. Well, yeah, you know you know what I mean, right into the preview. So my preferred starting eleven is as follows. A five uh, uh, a four, a four, three, one, two. Yeah, that's what I'm going to go with. A four, three, one, two. With one defensive, sorry, with one attacking midfielder. So my lineup is as follows Edouard Mendy in goal. A back four of Cesar Azpilicueta playing in his natural position this time. I'm going to give Kurt Zuma a go. Andreas Christensen. Ben Chilwell. So yeah, that's my back four. I'm going to go with Jorginho. And Golo Conte and Mateo Kovacic as the midfield back, a mid the midfield, yeah, as the midfield. I'm gonna go with Hakim Ziyech as the attacking midfielder, and I'm gonna go with a strike partnership of Timo Werner 
and Olivier Giroud. So yeah, that's Mendy. Aspilicueta, Zuma, Christensen, Chilwell, Kante, Kovacic, Jorginho, Ziyech, Werner, Giroud. So yeah, that's my preferred starting eleven. And now the eleven I think Thomas Tuchel is going to go with. I think he's going to go with the same lineup, the same for well, a similar lineup. Yeah, a similar lineup and the same formation he used against Liverpool. So, I'm predicting that he'll go with a 3-4-2-1 with two wing backs or wide midfielders, however you'd like to call them. So I'm going to say he goes with Edouard Mendy in goal, a back three of Cesar Azpilicueta, Andreas Christensen, and Antonio Rudiger, a midfield four of Rhys James, Angolo Conte, Jorginho, and uh, Marcus Alonso. I see him returning to this team for this game, by the way. Um, he is going to go with two attacking midfielders in, uh, in Kai Havertz. I think he's going to start this game. In Kai Havertz and Hakim Ziyech with Timo Werner up top. Now, on to the lineup. I think Carlo Ancelotti is going to field for Everton. So, um, he is going, he is going to go with Now, I believe that for them, for Everton, James Rodriguez, their star player, is um, injured and won't be available for this game. So I think Carlo Ancelotti is going to go with... With a four four two. He's probably he's gonna pick England International Jordan Pickford in goal. He's gonna go with a back four of Luca Dinier, Yeri Mina, Michael Keane, and Mason Hallgate. He's gonna go with a midfield four of Bernard. On of Bernard, Gilfie Sigurdsson, Abdullah Decore, Alex Iwobi, and I'm sorry, and Alex Iwobi. That's their midfield four, I'm predicting. And he's going to go with two strikers in the Brazilian, Richarlison, and uh, Dominic Calvert Lewin. Yeah, those two are going to be our danger men. Sorry, their danger men to us. Because Calvert Lewin and Richarlison, they are ballers, man. You give them the space, they will punish you. So. So, yeah, and now that's the lineup I think Carlo Ancelotti is going to choose for Everton. Now, now we are going to go, now we are going to do a combined 11. Now it's Edward Mendy versus Jordan Pickford. 
Now, I don't know why Gareth Southgate insists on Jordan Pickford every single time for England duty, whether it's international tournaments or friendlies. But he is a trash goalkeeper. Well, having said that, he might have just turned into Brian Manuel Neuer against us. But anyway, we move on. But yeah, he has been trash almost all season. Yeah, trash all season. And that is putting it lightly. So Edouard Mendy is by far the better shot stopper and the better keeper. So yeah, Edouard Mendy goes in for in the combined 11. Now, now we move on to, we're going with a 4 triple 2 by the way. So now we, uh, yeah, a 4 triple 2 formation. So now our back four. The right back spot is going to be contested between Rhys James and Cesar Aspilicueta versus Mason Hallgate and um, Ben Godfrey. And Rhys James gets in. Now, the first... Now, this is if everyone is fit, by the way. We are not taking injuries into account. Um, now, the first defender, Michael Keane versus... Tiago Silva. Tiago Silva gets in. Centre back partner, Andres Christensen versus um, Michael Keane and Yeri Mina. Now, I'm going to go with Michael Keane here. Luca Digne versus Ben Chilwell and Marcus Alonso. Luca Digne gets in automatically. He is one of the best left backs in the league. Now the two, now the midfield pivot, that is Abdullah Decore and Matteo Kovacic. Yeah, Abdullah Decore and Alan, and uh, Abdullah Decore, Alan, and Gomez versus Jorginho, Kante, and Kovacic. Kante gets in, and this is this is no injuries. Whatsoever, by the way. And his midfield partner, Alan. Very good for Napoli. And he's been decent for Everton as well. So, so yeah, midfield pivot, Alan and N'Golo Conte. Now the two attacking midfielders, who can easily be wide midfielders as well, on this formation... So that's Hamas Rodriguez and Gilfi Sigurdsson. Versus Mason Mount and Hakim Ziyech. Now... 
James, Rod- James Rodriguez 100% gets into this team. And now the other attacking midfielder position. Gilfie Sigurdsson versus Kai Havertz. It has to be Kai Havertz. And now the two stri- and now it's Dominic Calvert Lewin, Richarlison, and Joshua King versus Tammy Abraham, Olivier Giroud, and Timo Werner. Now Dominic Calvert Lewin gets in, and his mid- and his partner is going to be Olivier Giroud. So the combined eleven is as follows: Mendy, Aspilicueta, Silva, Keane, Dinier, Alan, Kante, Havertz, Rodriguez, Calvert Lewin, and Giroud. So my score prediction for this um, game. Now, they're going to give us a fight. But I think we have just about enough to get over the line. I'm going to say a scrappy 2-1 Chelsea. I do see Everton scoring though. So yeah. 2-1 2-1 Chelsea. Um, so yeah, that's the end of this video. Um, leave your score predictions in the comments below. Um, so yeah, social media is in the description below. Please remember to like, share, comment, subscribe, and turn on the bell notifications if you haven't already. And the like target for this video is 5 likes, so that would be great. 5 likes would be great helpful. Yeah. With that being said, you have been a wonderful audience. And this is Nippon Sharma signing off. Take care of yourselves. Peace. Up the Chels and London is blue. And I'm out of here. And I shall see you in the next video.